Hi, I wish you and all your dears one a splendid, a healthy, an appropriately wealthy, a cozy, a successful and a significant 2013. In this New Year's video, I'd like to share three things with you. Firstly, why do you do what you do? Secondly, once you know that, how are you going to communicate that to the people around you? And thirdly, what does that concretely mean? How do you get it done? Okay, here we go. Why do you do what you do? It's, uh, why is the main question? A lot of people start with what and how, but why is the main question? Why, why do you get out of bed? What makes you tick? What is it that really makes you excited? What are your deeper drivers? With me, my 20 years of mind power and 17 corporate years and having spoken in over 50 countries to over more than 300,000 people has given me a tremendous exposure and experience. And I'm, I know how it works for a lot of people. So I'm very excited to share that with others. My wife is my darling wife, Mary, who's still with me, of course, all the time. My parents and many friends and people I know who have issues, who have themes for which I have developed and experienced methods that can really help. So it, it's really exciting for me to speak up straight from the heart and what's in my head to share that with others. So once you find your why, you're in a really deep and good flow. And flow is like water. So that brings you to the how. How do you bring that water, that flow to the other people? There are three scenarios. First, it's like a, 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 a fire hose. Second, it's like when you when you give water to your plants. And third is a fountain. Let me go a little deeper into that. The first scenario, the, the, the fire brigade hose, is very effective, but it's very direct. It's very confronting. There's often a lot of ego in it. And actually, there's often a lot of telling and not asking questions. So you have to be very considerate when you use that method. It works, it's effective, but when do you use it? The secondly is... It's when you give water to the plants, you go by plant by plant by plant, it's focus. If you give the right energy, the right attention, the right water to the plants you want to grow, the people you want to grow. And thirdly is a, a fountain. And I see a fountain ideally as a this donut type of fountain. So this water keeps coming and it's very soft and it's warm and it's, it's nice. It's wonderful to look at. It's nice to stand under it. And they're very different three communication scenarios. I want you to look at your own communication and check out how is it distributed? Is it one third, one third, one third? And when do you use what? My own experience is that the fire hose method, yes, it works once in a while, but you have to be very critical because often you blow people away. The second is very good when you focus. What do you give attention? I'm going to give more and more attention to videos, to e-programs, because that's my method to approach a lot of people. But I do it primarily from the fountain approach. Abundance, give a lot, share, and, and let people experience and be attractive uh, so that their sixth sense is, is attracted to, to come your way. Now, once you have figured out your optimal communication methods, then what do you concretely do to get there? And that reminds me of a marketing course I once followed in California more than 20 years ago with Jay Abram. And he said three very basic things. And I say from the point of getting more sales, more clients, but it's also to get more friends or to get more out of your relationships. And, but I do it from sales, because 2013 is hopefully a year that will bring you a lot of abundance, a lot of material good, because we live in a material world and you simply need some money to get the things done you want to do and help people, etc. Okay, here are the three things. Firstly, get more clients. <laughs> Secondly, sell these clients more. And thirdly, let these more clients that buy more, buy from you more frequently. Well, that is a magic formula, but there are three very different things. So if you manage to, to hire each category by 10%, actually your total sales will go up by 33%. If you manage that every category, more clients, sell them more, more frequent, goes up 20%, your total sales goes up 75% through the accumulative working of it. And if you do it 25%, each category actually almost grow 100%. Now, let me give you an example. In Holland, where I'm born and raised, we have this little spreadsheet sort of 
uh, no, not sort of, spreadsheets called Eru Gold Cup. And there was always one taste. Now, what have they done lately? First of all, to get more clients, they put clear displays in the supermarket. So you see that one taste and more clients buy it. And then they introduce several tastes. They make the old cheese variation. They make it with blue cheese. They make it with, with uh, spicy in it. So all of a sudden, there are four or five different variations. So people buy more. And then they make like a, an attractive plan that if within two months you have bought so many times, you can win a trip to Hawaii. Well, this is one example, but you can think about it. And that doesn't only go in business, it also goes in your and my private life. You can approach more people you know already. You can have longer and better talks and thicker time with them. And you can do that more frequent and the quality of your life will go up tremendously. So let me summarize this little New Year's video. So check it out. Why do you really do what you do? What are your deeper drivers? Get into the flow and then communicate with the world via three methods and be critical about it with which one you choose. The fire hose, the giving water to each plant or the fountain. And then thirdly, what are you going to do to get more clients to sell them more? and to sell them more frequently. And again, this is both at the professional point of view and from the personal point of view. You make your translation. I will continue to send you videos to make you blogs. By the way, in Holland, in the Dutch speaking area, in January, I will start a major e-program with Fighter Minders and Mind Power TV and all that. And I promise you that in the course of 2013, we'll start all of that also in English. So I can worldwide approach a lot of people because I have a lot to share and I love to do it to improve the quality of as many people as I can. Bless you. Have a fabulous year and we'll see each other again soon. Bye-bye.